Okay, so welcome back to another week's channel. This week I am going to the National Gallery that's behind me. You can see it's really beautiful. It is noisy because we are in central London, Balver Square. Uh, police going by now and cars and buses and stuff. But yeah, so long story short, in this video I wanted to talk about Lucian Freud. I will be going on to another video talking about Sigmund Freud and in a later video talking about Bella Freud as a series of the idea how art, fashion and psychology all submerge and hopefully you enjoy and we get some interesting things to see and some great comments from you afterwards I hope. So let's go in. <laughs> And for me it's just the actual cat is looking at you directly and then she's looking elsewhere and I was going to say more in the sense of um, where her direction is intention place to go through because if you look on the left you've got the dead cock's head and you look on the right and it's flowers and it's like symbolism of femininity and masculinity therefore it's probably going into a whole kind of Freud area now. It's funny because I just want to go over and see if that one in particular has grabbed my attention and found them twice in the Of course, cleverly, it would go straight to Bella's work, which I was talking about, I didn't expect that to be here. And then you've got Lucian's over there, and I'm sure we'll probably find something somewhere. So, you can get these postcards, and uh, what's quite funny is, you can't take a picture of it, but you can buy it, but it's a really bad picture of the real picture, which was fantastic. I just don't get it. Why not do a good picture of it? We would buy it. Hi, so uh, I've just been to it. It was really, really beautiful. I'm going to get the book. I just didn't today because I didn't feel like carrying things back. Uh, I'm going to just get it on another day when I've not got a small bag and some everything. Uh, beautiful area. Afterwards, uh, go round, look around the exhibitions, I definitely would say. I got to go on a weekday, I would say it's another tip, it's slightly cheaper, but also less crowded and you get to see bits like I got to actually look closely to the bank of sunflowers to some people's demise where they would get their cameras trying to get their selfies, which is another story. But when you come out and I'm with a friend and I'm going to go to the Christmas market just down below and get some mulled wine. You can get hot chocolate if that's your thing or whatever your thing is, but that's my thing. And uh, I look forward to showing you the next story of what's going on. However, next week it won't be what I was mentioning in the preview. Next week we'll be going down the route with ranking Tracy Emin and also Dylan Jones. So I hope you enjoy that. And 
look forward to your comments.